How about the famous strength, weaknesses, opportunity, and threat analysis? From the book, Good to Great, Can You Face the Brutal Facts? And who, what's the quote, you can't handle the truth? I'll give you a hint. A Few Good Men, right, with Tom Cruise and Jack Nicholson. You have to have candid discussions about your strengths, your weaknesses, your opportunities and threats. A traditional SWOT analysis looks like this. And what happens? You file it in the drawer. What we recommend is you do a SWOT analysis by category. So what are my strengths of my people? What are my strengths in my technology or my weaknesses in my processes? So you need to look at it this way. In addition, you can look at it by function. So every leader in your organization could say, what's my strengths for human resources? What's my strengths for IT? What's my strengths for sales and marketing? Think about looking at it that way. And then nothing gets done without action. So let's suppose you have a strength in marketing. We have a brand awareness of the, say, baby boomer generation. But a weakness is nobody under 50 knows who you are. And then you have an opportunity to rebranding and use digital marketing. You need to take action. And that action turns into a plan. If you don't put it on paper, you don't assign dates, you don't assign accountability and ownership, it's not going to get done. Pretty simple. How would you rate yourself on a SWOT analysis? Have you done one recently? 